All right, so here he is, one of the better offensive takedown guys we have in the UFC, DC. And if anyone is well equipped to speak to this, it is you. The opponent knows what's coming. At least to this point in the UFC, no one's been able to stop. He just has to keep him away. Because the moment this guy gets close enough to either grab a leg or make body contact, right. now you're in trouble. He has a knowledge and an understanding of position from a lifetime of just all grappling, judo, wrestling, uh, Sambo, he does it all, and he has just so many ways to get you to the floor. This guy once told me that if he can get your leg, he's going to finish. Right. Because he's going to give you so many things to think about, you will not be able to process and keep up with him, and eventually you're on the mat. It's unbelievable to watch him apply that knowledge to the mixed martial arts fight. And as the wrestlers say, this is not a guy you want anywhere near your bracket. No, you don't want him in the bracket. All right, here he is, DC. In my mind, this is the most dominant force in the MMA game today. The undisputed UFC lightweight champion, your AKA teammate, Khabib Nurmagomedov. Yeah, and for Khabib, it's the well-rounded skill set that has propelled him to one of the longest undefeated streaks in mixed martial arts history. No missteps, no mistakes, no underestimation of opponents. Always prepared, always ready to go, and he can rely on his the coaching he gets, also, on the ability that he has to carry him to victory time and time again. Wrestling, sambo, jiu-jitsu, striking. The guy has it all. I know you listed striking last, but your head coach, Javier Mendez, says sometimes he's going southpaw yeah. in training. We haven't seen just how good a striker he is. We saw shades in the McGregor fight. Yes. But not complete. But technically, he has so many skills that he has not even displayed to the MMA community yet. All right, another big spot for Khabib Nurmagomedov here tonight. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Nurmagomedov is two years his senior. The rest is nearly identical. Now here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. If you use your fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a wrestler holding a professional record of 23 wins, one loss. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting at a backpack color Russia, Islam Makachev! And now introducing his opponent, fighting at the red corner. This man is a grappler, holding a professional record of 29 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting at the Republic of Dagestan, Russia, Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. think he might have the best jab in this division, certainly using it effectively here. I mean, one of the best jabs in the world across all combat sports. The way that it just comes out, it's beautiful. The backside hand is always at the chin. The elbows tuck to the ribs. The jab goes out. The jab comes right back to the face. It's picture-perfect technique, almost like a Taibo class or something like that. Nermago Manoff gets caught with that punch. 
which the guard lands the right hand. So one minute into this fight, and as many people expected, the action absolutely crazy, back and forth. This is a full-on brawl piece. It's hard to watch a fight like this and call a fight like this because you never know when somebody's going to take that one shot that finishes the fight. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Big ball from punch land. Now he gets back to range. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Oh, is he a good counter striker? Counters beautifully with the left hand. Look to the head there by Nermako Meta. Just over three minutes to go round one. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Just misses with the jab there. Oh, what a punch. Well, you start to really worry about the wrestling, and there's that left hand from Cubby. Underrated. I mean, it's a very underrated part of his game, his ability to stand and strike with anybody in the UFC. Oh, yeah, right hand. Both guys really throwing with authority. So 44 total strikes have now landed for Khabib Nurmagomedov. It's okay. Just misses with the straight left hand. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Nurmagomedov gets caught with that punch. Nice combination of strikes to the body, as the great Daniel Cormier might say. You make an investment to the body, and then you cash upstairs. Cash upstairs. Grab that ticket. You're a big time gambler, John. Bet on the underdog, we'll cash it out. The underdog, the box right. shot. The pitch in the head's gonna show itself. I like that. He loaded up on that right hand, too. Put that down. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Magomedov gets touched by that kick there. Yeah, left hook found its target. So he lands a double jab there. He continues to work off of that weapon, and you felt like that was a big key for him coming to you. Very important for him to start popping that jab. He's doing it over and over again, and he's finding a ton of success. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. Mago Medoff gets hit by that leg kick. Oh, that's a nice strike there by Nurmago Medoff. Yeah, Habib Nurmago Medoff is not only a wrestler, he's a full-on mixed martial artist now, and it showed in that exchange. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Just misses with the straight right. Under a minute now to go in this one. Misses with the left hook. Ooh, roundhouse kick. Add that to his highlight reel. Big punch land. Marco Medov gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. Nice job with that follow-up shot as well. Oh, look at that jab. Snapped his head back. His jab gets to the target so fast, and he always brings his hands right back to his face. Right punches there. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Nice punch, land. All right, here, final seconds of round one. Round two next. Let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC, and if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, man, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space, and eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets under. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Good stick. Oh, lands another shot to the body, beautifully placed as he continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. And he 
caught the kick. Well, they've made all the right reads here tonight, and there's another one. Beautiful read on the leg strike as he catches it and then returns fire with a punch of his own. So they have got the timing down here at this point of the fight. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. Good jab. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Well, I know Javier Mendez has said Khabib likes to go south by times in training. He looks pretty good on the feet tonight. He looks really good in the stand-up. That is a part of his game that's underappreciated. He's a very good striker, and as he gets more comfortable in the octagon, he'll continue to show. Oh, and he caught the kick. And he continues to work the body here. What a punch. Doesn't take much for the redness to start. Look at the left side of his body there. Nasty. Back to the body shots now. That one blocked. Nice kick. Oh, great head movement there. Slips his head off the center line, and defensively, that's exactly what you're looking for. It's almost like he can telegraph when the punch is coming. And when he sees it, he just makes a slight little movement, right or left, to get out of the way and avoid those shots. Oh, tagged him with that right hand. What a strike that was. What a strike that he is landing over and over again. His opponent will need to make some adjustments. Oh, and he got tagged by that combination. His coach said on Thursday to us, it has to be punches and bunches. It has to be volume. And his student has certainly followed up on that. So much volume, but the accuracy, the accuracy of this fighter is truly unbelievable. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Nurmago Medov gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Connects with the right hand. Pretty good punch, that one. Nice right punch by this young man. Oh, nice jab by him there. And I guess on the other side, hard to get your offense going when your head keeps getting snapped back like a Pez dispenser. Every time he tries to go forward and use his own offense, the jab is stopping him in his track. He's doing a great job of fighting behind him. All right, so he continues to land that patented jab and keeping his opponent at bay. You can know that it's coming, but until you're in there with him, the speed and the power of that jab is something you can't really prepare for. Nice straight punch. Well, eventually you know he's going to turn this defense into offense, but he's certainly doing a nice job on the defensive end of this one. They talk about the feeling out process. He's getting his opponent's timing. Now he's blocking everything. Expect counters as we go forward. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Now connects with the right. Oh, he tagged him with the jab on the counter. Big body Ooh, What a punch. Well, one got through. That kick was blocked. Oh, misses with the jab. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may blow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strike. Chicago Medov gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Right on the button. Beautiful. Almost in range with the straight left, but that's a miss. Alright, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC. And I'd imagine a lot of these replays are going to be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're going to see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. Take a seat here. All right. I need you to slow down and relax. Calm that line, okay? Let's get this stand up under control. 
All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His striking was money in that previous round. Got to think he'll pick up where he left off. All about the money. Three back. Cash. Dollar, dollar bills, y'all. Every single strike he landed was on point. It was accurate, and it was heavy. Every time he let loose, he was able to land and land to great effect. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. <laughs> Big kick lands. Right hook to the body. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Man, he's timing his shots nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you insist on bringing in Tom Brady. Stop him. John, stop him. Nice. The combination lands for him. He is really putting his strikes together tonight. I mean, he's feeling himself tonight, John. He's doing a great job of putting everything together. Oh, man. Snapped his head back with the uppercut there. You can see him throw his entire body into that uppercut. Big kick land. Back and forth we go here. Nermago Medov gets caught by that straight punch. That'll get his attention. He looks like Pac-Man. He's taking so many strikes to the head. Renato Medov's now dealing with a cheat cut. Try to establish that jab. Well, that nose isn't going to be able to take too many more as he doubles up on the jab there. So good to watch MMA up balls and watch guys now fight behind the jab. Liver kick. Oh, such a natural jab, and there it is again as he gets the hand right to the target. I mean, right to the target, John. It's like a dude sitting there with a red target on his nose, just getting beat up, hit bullseye after bullseye after bullseye. I love his ability to faint once and then throw that jab right behind him. It's nasty. of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch, I just put a smile on my face. Well, you gotta think he's gonna enjoy watching this one back tomorrow morning. He has landed a ton of significant strikes and really a guy who has been a monster in the gym finally putting it together here in the octagon. To go Whoa! He's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. Nermago Medov gets caught by that straight punch. Can't take too many more of those. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Marco Medov gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. He's got to shore up the defense here, though. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Well, defense doesn't necessarily win championships in MMA, but he's doing a nice job blocking these shots. He's not allowing his opponent to get any damage off one of my blocks with all these attacks. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. Oh, straight to the body by Nermago Medov. Combination lands for him. It was hard to see a miss in that sequence. He's put it all together. I mean, everything is just flowing. He's like in a zone. It's like the basketball who becomes twice the size. This guy today is looking at focus wins in his opponent. Nice one, two there. just got a great feel for the striking realm early in this one. The timing is on point. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with his beautiful leg kick. Just out of range with that strike. Lands the right hand. Oh, man, that cut is nasty. Damaging punch there. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do. If we can win this round, I need you to get the takedown. Ten seconds to go. 
points over the top. Nice right punch followed by a left. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship rounds. All right, so that's the end of the round. Potential adversity here. He's got a cut on his cheek sustained from that strike in the round. Now the focus becomes maximizing these 60 seconds, shutting that cut and preventing it from becoming a major factor here moving forward. Well, he had a lot more than a puncher's chance coming in. Big knockdown for him in the previous round. DC, talk us through the highlight. He got in his opponent's face, landed that big punch that put his opponent flat on his back. He couldn't get the finish, but if he lands one more time just like that, he will get the victory. All right, next round is underway. You know these are two of the more conditioned fighters on the roster, so cardio is not going to be an issue here. And for some fighters, you know, you can have one of those adrenaline dumps or the cardio abandons you on fight night. Not the case for these two guys. Both look very fresh as we start this next round. Ooh, big shot, man. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Well, just as he did the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Magomedov gets tattooed by that straight punch. Watch knees to the body. Great punch. Push on the elbow. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Oh, I love the jab. I know you love the jab. That was a nice one. It's my favorite punch in all the fight. Oh, he got real good, too. Nurmagomedov's hook shot is blocked. Saw that coming from a mile away. Lands a nice straight punch there. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. What do you follow up a great punch like this with? I'm excited to see what happens. Well, confidence is high. I repeat, confidence is high. And I got to think when you knock a fighter down in the previous round, that's going to think you can do it again. I mean, confidence is key in anything you do in regards to fighting. So for him to secure that knockdown early, he has to feel good going forward. Oh, and he lands another punch there, and you can tell at this point he is going right at that cut on his opponent. Right at the cut on the eye. Just make sure he knows that I'm going to be targeted. And keep your hands up, and when the hands go up, he will then change the target down low, trying to find finishes. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. That's a big strike right there. Under three minutes remain in round four. And he landed the right hand there. Pretty good right hand. Now tripling up on the jab. Well, if you're gonna leave your body that wide open, you're gonna pay the price, and he certainly did there. As it goes, oh! he's in trouble. He's hurt bad. All right, so a nice job there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shots. That's it. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Two minutes to go. Hold your ground. I need that one stuck in. Nice strike. Trying to establish that jab once again. Ooh, nice right hand. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Nermago Medoff. Well, he continues to stay busy. What do they say? Shot there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Huge shots there. An uppercut landed. Oh, what a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh, he might be out. Torso on the right side, major bruising, and it's only getting worse. Oh, and he 
connects with a punch there. Oh! oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Got clip with the right hand. Oh, big left hook there. Back and forth we go. Misses with that punch. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Looked like he clipped him with a left hand counter there. Final seconds here. Oh, that's a nice strike. 20 minutes down, potentially five to go. So the crowd voicing its appreciation after that round. We had a knockdown courtesy of a punch midway through. DC, here's your highlight. It was straight. He threw him in combination and landed that big punch that really did hurt his opponent. Lesser men would have been done. He's got a tough guy in front of him. He will have to go back to this again. He will have to get back to this action if he wants to get the desired finish. Fifth and final round. Good. Unable to connect with the right hand there. Oh, nice right hand down. Jab there by Nermago Meta. How about that chin? You wonder if the offensive fighter's gonna start to get frustrated here. Most stiffed on all these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best. Right there, the blow in the fight. I mean, it was perfect. It was absolutely perfect, John. Great place on that up. Beautiful strike. Well, he's up, but oh, is he hurt. Nice straight right lance. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. Nice knee to the midsection there. Oh, big left. Back and forth we go. Huge result and a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the big knockout win. That could hold up as one of the better KOs of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 49 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, Khabib the Eagle, Mimado Mena. All right, so there he is, the man of the hour. What a massive knockout for him to get this win in style tonight.